What's going on guys, John Santos and in today's video what we're going to cover is the best apps to use to run your business on the go. Alright, now in this one we're going to cover the apps that you're definitely going to want to use, the services that you're going to want to sign up for to make your life easier in managing and growing your company. I'll show you guys some of the back end features of how these all connect and work so you could better manage your workflow and communicate with your customers, communicate with your partners, with your team, with outside people, so you're all on the same page. All right, we're gonna start by covering the first one. All right, and that is going to be Google Drive. All right, I'm a big proponent of Google Drive. Now what they offer is essentially Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel, and PowerPoint, all under their own branded Google Drive, Google Docs program. All right, so the first one is Google Drive, and what Google Drive allows you to do is a, it's essentially a Dropbox, for, but for Google, and it allows you to store your photos, your documents, your videos, whatever you need to store up on the cloud so you can access it from any computer. Whether you log into your account on your laptop, whether you log into an account from a school computer, whether you log into it from the iPhone or from your Android device, all of the documents sync directly to wherever you need them so you can pull them up at any time. Now with that in mind, you're gonna to wanna to get your Gmail account. All right, your Gmail account gives you access to all of this. It gives you access to the Drive, gives you access to the Google Docs, which we will be covering right now, which is essentially the Word document, text type of document that you can create business plans on, you can create simple uh, letters, whatever your little heart imagines when it comes to creating documents, Google Docs is what's gonna create that for you. The other one that you're gonna use almost as much as the Google Docs is going to be Google Slides. Now the Google Slides is gonna be amazing when it comes to creating presentations, when it comes to showing information, do all kinds of really cool stuff with it, it's gonna help you out a lot. And what's really cool is that you could also use images or stuff on your phone, you can add it right to your presentation and it syncs up to your docs. And you could also collaborate with people. So if your partner is supposed to be adding information to it, you can give them access to that, to that document and you guys can be working on it at the same time and each of you will see what changes are being made in real time. Now in the Google Drive, you're gonna have Google Sheets. Google Sheets is essentially Microsoft Excel, but it's free. And it almost does every single thing that Microsoft Excel does, but free. It does have a little bit of limitations or workarounds that you have to do to make it work exactly like Excel does, but 90% of it is almost the same. If I can use the cloud on any one of those things, I'll use it. So then that way I don't have to worry about, did I save it on my computer? Did I save it up on Dropbox? Everything that I work on, on the drive, it makes it super simple and super easy to access anything, anywhere you go. And now the last but not least, the Google Voice app. All right, now the Google Voice app, essentially what it does is it gives you another phone on your phone. Now, it's not just giving you a phone on this phone, it's a phone number that you could sync across multiple lines. So say you have a cell phone number, and then you also have a separate house phone number, what you could do is the Google Voice becomes the primary business number. So if somebody calls that Google Voice number, you decide if it goes to the house phone first or if it comes to the cell phone first. And wherever you may be at during the day, like if you know you're gonna be at home during the night, then you can have that Google Voice number call your house phone or vice versa. So essentially what it does is it allows you to connect multiple phones to one number, all right? And you could also make calls with your computer or wherever you may be. It has some great international rates. They allow you to like call to China for like two cents a minute or something. It gives you your personal voicemail. It gives you text messaging. It gives you the ability to make calls directly from your device. It doesn't look any different. You just open up the app and you start making some phone calls. You're gonna wanna test it out for yourself because I know that you guys are gonna love it and it's something that you're gonna be able to put on business cards, marketing materials, and you can feel comfortable that you'll be able to keep it on there for the long run. Because then, regardless if your cell phone number changes, your Google Voice number can remain the same. 
So overall, it's a win-win that you're going to want to check out. It's going to save you a lot of time and a lot of hassle and a lot of random calls from coming in to your primary line. Maybe you just want to talk to your friends and family on your cell phone and you don't want to give this out to business. Well, now Google Voice allows you to give that phone number out and you know that it's a business-related call. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I try to give all kinds of information that I had that I wanted to share in a way that was condensed and available for you to start using so you could realize how you could work on a couple of different projects all from one platform. All right, so comment down below if you have any questions about either suite. And more than anything, make sure you, that you check out next week's video where we're going to break down a couple of different apps so you guys can see how you can use those in the course of your business and more importantly how you can run your business on the go so make sure you hit the like button down below subscribe to this channel hit the notification bell follow me on instagram more than anything guys let's get it talk soon bye